Hello everyone. Excellent afternoon everyone. Excellent afternoon to every one of us. So I'm highly welcome to this afternoon's broadcast. Welcome, welcome, welcome. <laughs> Today is by the grace of God. See, I cut my finger while trying to prep for this um, our not bread cooking. I just cut my finger. So I don't know how today will go, but it will go well. <laughs> all right, so we are highly welcome. I need to open up the pot. I'm in the kitchen. I'm in the kitchen, and we must do what we must do. Okay, so I'm, I was boiling eggs, and um, it's like the water is getting much. I need to scoop out some water from there. I'm using one hand to work today. One hand cooking. <laughs> so I'm back to London, Ontario, and courtesy of my beloved sister's house, Sister Bukola. That's where I am. I'm in her kitchen today. And like uh, my advertise, we are going to be cooking, um, making some bread with nuts, okay? Because of my finger, I couldn't uh, make the almond one to show us ahead of time but i have the peanut one okay i have the peanut bread the peanut bread is here this is snow flour and is a peanut bread very healthy for menopausal women okay so i have it done already here for you remember i'm working with one hand <laughs> god will help us today <laughs> Ah, dear, dear, dear. So, we're going to make this peanut bread. We, I will tell you the ingredients and then we go ahead. For the almond, we're going to do it from beginning to the end here. Okay? We'll do it from beginning. So, this is our peanut bread. <laughs> this is our peanut bread. No flour. It's sick, it's thick, it's just coming from the oven. Peanuts, bread. Very healthy for you. No flour. No sugar. Very, very nice. And it's very tasty. I tell you. So, we all know that nuts are very good for us. Number one, they are filling. And they have monosaturated fat. So they are very, very good for us. They are also good because they also help you with fiber. Okay? They, like this now. This bread is enough for me. That one loaf I've made and it's just from half cup of peanut butter okay my finger didn't let me knead the dough very well but I tried my best I had to tie the so painful but <laughs> so this is the bread we know that at this age for us as menopausal women that we should be careful about flour so because of that, we need to find alternatives to flour. Today's broadcast is to show you that you can have your bread and not eat flour. And some people complain that even the carb, carbohydrates in oats, is still much for them, especially for, for diabetic people. So like this peanut bread, I'm enjoying it, that's why I'm still eating and eating. It's very, very good for diabetic patients, very good for menopausal women. Because the nuts that you use, you can use any nuts, you can use peanuts, ground nuts, it's peanut, almond. If there's time and my hand can permit me, I'll also show you how to make a simple almond one. You can use basil nuts, you can use any nuts you like to make this, any nuts you have around you. You can use it and as much as possible don't remove the back of the nut because of that fiber we are talking about okay 
Right, for this, it's just five simple ingredients. And this bread. And this peanut or granite bread. <laughs> five simple ingredients. So, for those of us in Nigeria that like granite and bread, this is just okay for you to cover everything. <laughs> so here we have peanut butter. We have peanut butter. This is the peanut bread. We have peanut butter, eggs, vinegar, baking soda, and if you like, you can put honey or you can put sweetener for those of you who like sweet tongs, okay? You can put any sweetener that you like inside it. Try to press the soda blood will stop flowing. <laughs> So we'll go, we'll make this. I'll show you how to make this and then we'll now come back and make the um, almond one. But remember this is aging with grace. Let me not forget to share, share, share. This is aging with grace. If you've joined me live, you can greet so I can welcome you to this afternoon's broadcast. Welcome, welcome to every one of us. And also let's share, share. There's fun in sharing. Today is really a big sacrifice, I'm telling you. Ordinarily, after cutting this hand, I would have just gone to go and start mourning the hand. But I said the devil is a liar. He's not going to deprive people because I know there's someone here who needs this recipe. There's someone here whose healing will depend on this recipe. There's someone here who has been battling with, oh, I love bread, but I don't know how I can take bread without flour and they are telling me to stop so this is a real you see it's bread nothing complete bread it's still bringing out smoke because i made it down now and you know it's really feeling and it's feeling for a long period that's one good thing about it so let's share share if you join me like you can greet so i can welcome you to this afternoon's broadcast and help me to share 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 to your friends share to your groups that you belong share to your family share all around i need to put off my egg light <laughs> okay so let's share share who is sharing with me if you're sharing with me say it there that you're sharing that you're sharing share your story share everywhere so that people can join us this evening be a blessing to someone okay and as we're sharing i want to also to tell us that we also we are on other social media platforms aging with grace if you go to tiktok aging with grace if you go to Instagram, Aging with Grace. If you go to um, Facebook, Aging with Grace. YouTube, also Aging with Grace. Okay? And once we finish now, you can report. We repost it there and you can send to your friends who are not on Facebook to join us and to watch. Do me a favor. Don't allow this to be only for you. Make sure that. Um, all that people are getting benefits from it, okay? And like I said, greet to encourage me, post, say things to encourage me, and also to make me know what you want. Because it's when you, you tell me what you want, when you tell me the topics you want me to handle, or things that are bothering you that you need answers for, I'll be able to know what and what I should keep bringing your way okay all the topics that have been treating and have been handling here are from what people are asking questions that people ask so when people ask these questions i come your way with those things okay all right so if you join me life like i said greet so i can welcome you to this evening's broadcast nobody has greeted yet so i have not seen okay esther how are you Esther, 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 oh yeah, Romy, thank you. 
and Adrian has done in watching, but they have not greeted. Okay, so you're all highly welcome. Like I said, feel free to share, share, like, comment, and ask questions on my other social media platform, and even on this live broadcast, okay? And you can also connect with me personally on my WhatsApp. My WhatsApp number is... My WhatsApp number is plus two three four plus two three four seven zero three five one five one six four two plus two three four seven zero three five one five one six four two so that's my whatsapp number plus two three four seven zero three five one five one six four two so you can chat me you can connect with me and you can ask any question and your questions will be answered and if you need any of my products also chat on these numbers and you get the products all right so plus two three four plus two three four seven zero three five one five one six four two okay and remember for those of you that didn't watch on monday go and watch monday video it's very very important for you okay okay agent has done in your school run right on right on right on <laughs> all right so does stanley says coach good afternoon it's been a long time thank god i'm here this afternoon thank god you're here because we are making peanut bread this bread is so sweet you see anytime i talk about it i take a bite <laughs> We're making peanut bread today okay and it's very simple in a few minutes you can finish it you can finish making it especially if you have your peanut butter down now i made my peanut butter by myself from groundnut i blended it and i had my plain peanut okay hello esther kisola good afternoon agent is turning i'm glowing <laughs> why won't i glow healthy food healthy supplements that's it now luchi oh now Oluchi, thank you for um, watching. Luche is not my kitchen, no, it's borrowed kitchen. <laughs> Luche says your kitchen is gorgeous. <laughs> I'm in a borrowed kitchen, no. I borrowed from Sister Bukola in your life. She runs Airbnb. In fact, anytime you visit Canada or you're in London, Ontario, look for this Airbnb. It's the best that I've ever stayed in. Okay? It's a home on its own. You can see the kitchen. The room very big, very beautiful, very clean, new house. So come to London, Ontario, you look for the house. Don't worry, if you ask me for the name of the Airbnb, I will tell you the name. And you can search for it online, book online, I tell you. And um, you will have the best treatment ever. So my host is um, Sister Bukola. So it's not my kitchen, Uche. <laughs> it's borrowed art. <laughs> all right great so we're going to cook we're going to cook 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 now and um like i said we'll bake our um, our peanut bread and then we'll now make our almond bread also it's my finger that made me not to do a sample of almond bread for you but we'll ride on like i said don't let anything discourage me me i will not i don't know about you so let's get to the kitchen. In five minutes, we are through with our peanut bread, okay? All right. So let me turn my camera. So this is our ingredients showing. And I'm going to mix them. So for our peanut butter, very simple, like I said, only five ingredients that you need. Five, no more than five ingredients. Let me show you what caught my finger. Me and my carelessness. See, this is what caught my finger today. When I was trying to push out, was trying to push it in when it came off. Instead of me to just remove it and hold, I forgot it had them um, three layers. I thought it was only two, so I forgot the last blade, and so that's what caught my finger. But like I said, I don't ever allow anything to bar me from doing what I'm supposed to do. So this is what I used to make the peanuts. You can see me still bringing it out from the blender, super blender. So it blended it very well for me. 
so i'm supposed to use one cup of peanut so when it wasn't enough i said let me blend more that's how this thing cut my finger oh. <laughs> so this i'm trying to scoop in one cup don't worry i'll turn the camera now for you to see that part Okay, so that's one cup of peanuts. You can see it now very well. So that's one of the ingredients we are using today. One cup of peanuts. And then we're going to put it in now into the mixing bowl. So I'll put it into the mixing bowl. But one thing we should remember is that flawless nuts like peanuts, almond nuts, bread, is very, very healthy and they are high in protein. They are yeast free, they are good for people who are vegan and they are gluten free, loaded with seeds and nuts, perfect for your breakfast and lunch. It's very, very simple to make, okay? And um, very, very good for you. It doesn't um, need much time. You don't need to um, knead so, so hard. It's, it's very very easy to knead also so we're going to add in one cup of peanut butter like I have here this is one cup I'm going to put it now into the I'll put it into the bowl I don't want to use too many spots for the same thing so I'll put it into the bowl into my mixing bowl one hand you are not working with one hand today so i'm putting my peanuts inside the mixing bowl remember already peanuts are already already contains a lot of oil so there's no need for any form of oil in this peanut butter and already because it's made in as a butter the the oil is already out the oil is already out from it okay so that's my peanut butter in the bowl then i'm supposed to use three eggs for one cup of peanut butter so i have my eggs here one two and three so th those are my three eggs i'll break them into i'll break them into the i'll break them into the mixing bowl now hey, camera, oh, this is my finger <laughs> this is my finger today is today <laughs> this thing that caught my finger <laughs> let me remove it you're not the one i'm doing <laughs> Okay, so that I can have enough space to work with. Alright, so I have three eggs and then I have my peanut butter inside the bowl. So I'm going to break my... Working with one finger. <laughs> today is today. Alright, can we help me? So one... Two. and then three uh, the third eggs okay so I have my eggs then the next thing I'm going to put now would be our vinegar we're going to put our vinegar one tablespoon of vinegar okay so this is one tablespoon so i'm going to pour in one tablespoon of vinegar so one tablespoon of vinegar in Then 
I just want it to be a little sweet because I'm not the only one taking this. I'm also going to put one tablespoon of honey. But you can do without it. And you can use any sweet now of your choice, okay? My husband doesn't like sweetness, so it's because of him I'm using vinegar. But the one I showed us as um, the one I've done, I used um, I used sweetener. And remember, the best honey in the world, which I don't have here now, I've ordered some things already, is a forever honey that is cold pressed, okay? Then I'm going to put some baking soda, just like um, one teaspoon of, half teaspoon of baking soda. If you're using sweetener, one tablespoon is okay if you're using sweetener. So those are the five ingredients you can see. Simple, simple, simple. So I will now start stirring everything together. If you have your mixer, you can put it in your mixer. You will continue stirring. Let me see if uh, there is a... Uh, you can mix. If you have your mix, mixer, you can mix together, you can blend together. But remember, I'm in a borrowed kitchen, so... Let's just use our fork until everything is thoroughly mixed. Ask your questions, make your comments. We're making our dough now. So you mix it until it's thoroughly mixed, then you add to your baking, your baking pan and you bake it in the oven. Remember, the peanut is already done, don't bake for too long. Then for those of you who don't mind using microwave, just two minutes in microwave and it's done, okay? So that's our dough. Our dough is nearly ready. And then um, you put inside your baking pan. And you bake it. And when you finish baking, your bread is going to come out like real normal bread. Okay? That's the finished bread. And I'm still so myself tasting that lovely bread. Just want to pick a glass, take water. So grab your peanut butter. And I'm here eating and eating. Once I touch it, it's like in my mouth and I'm it's not easy. I can hardly touch it without wanting to eat it. You can use it for sandwiches. You can use it for snacks. You can actually cut it and still add your 
mayonnaise. Remember, I showed us how to do mayonnaise last week. See, this finger will not let me hold this bread and cut it well. Well, you can slice it and then you have your bread. So that's my bread. <laughs> Let me take our questions and then I'll. We'll go over to the almond bread. Mm -hmm. Any questions? Okay. Esther Oye Romi, good evening. How are you? I should actually be facing the light. Let me bring my ring light. Yeah, will it reach to be on my face? <laughs> Okay. All right, so let me take our questions and we go and do the next thing. <laughs> That's that. Thank you, thank you. Thank you for telling me. Sorry, don't mind this, my finger. I receive fast healing in Jesus' name because I'm not going to. You regret it. Yes, it's so sharp. Oh. Hmm. That thing is something else. Ninja. It's so sharp. Oh, hmm. I should take pain relief. <laughs> I will drink aloe vera gel. Aloe vera gel is a good pain reliever. So when I finish, I'll go up and take care of myself. I just don't, didn't want to stop this video or say I will not do it or, you know, postpone. I just said I will do it today. Thank you all for caring. Hello, good afternoon, Udofia. <laughs> Marvelous Bakers, good afternoon. Aisha Bawa, good afternoon. Grace Amen, good afternoon. All right, so why I keep um, greeting everybody and taking time is that some people will come and chat me privately that I did not greet them. <laughs> hey. All right, okay. Thank you all. Ada Onun, Helen. Ruth, Joy, Lotechuku, it's been a while. How are you? Mm -hmm. Inka, Omofu, Ma, Ngozi Stanley, if baked, how long can it stay? Like one week or two weeks? Well, um, bread, even normal bread, if you keep it for too long, it's not good. So I spoke with a medical doctor and also a food scientist one time in America. So I was telling her I bought um, seeded bread. And the expiry date they put on the seeded bread had reached. So I was like, hey, I have this seeded bread. And they gave me two of it. And another person is bringing a third one. So I was telling her, I don't even know what to do about this seeded bread. She said, any food that now, even in UK, in all these places, they are trying to remove expiry dates. That what they are saying now is, when you hold your bread, if you didn't see mold in it, know that the bread is still good. <laughs> Go ahead and eat your bread. That some of those expiry dates were not um, really, really. It's like um, a game that they used to start it for food people and the rest. So these peanuts, like peanut butter, can stay for one month outside and nothing will happen to it. So I believe that it can stay for one week, two weeks, or you put it in the fridge. If you don't like fridge bread, you can leave it outside and be watching it. You know, and again, like what I tell people, this bread is like a on the go bread. Make your peanut like now. I got my groundnut, okay. This is my groundnut. I bought plenty of groundnuts from Nigeria, but this one I just decided to give those ones out. And then I, I, I bought this peanut here and poured it inside my um, I poured it inside this bag so that I'll be able to travel with it. The bottle was quite heavy, okay. So this is even Oyibo peanut and it's still tasty. So you can imagine Nigerian peanut will be far more sweeter. So that's the peanut. So what you could do if you want to make plenty at a time, make your peanut butter, okay? If you make your peanut butter plenty, you can keep it. Then anytime you now want to bake it, you bring out your peanut butter and add your eggs, your 
honey or sweetener, your baking soda, and you know, and everything is ready. Is that not the five ingredients we talked about today? Honey, baking soda, peanut butter, eggs, and then your vinegar. Okay, so you add those and you make it. So I hope that answers your question. I hope that answers your question. And um, who was I answering her question? Let me see. Who was I asking? Hey, eh, what is what is my phone doing again? Okay, so I hope I've answered your question. Um, let me go back to the page. I think I got thrown off. Okay, all right. All right, so let me take the next question and then we gotta make our almond. Don't go. We gotta make our almond. <laughs> all right, so Yomi Uche says Yomi. Esther says, How long will you stay inside the oven? Okay, so what you do when you bake for like, remember your peanut is already done. Okay, you can actually use fresh peanuts also for this and make it into a butter. But I like using already roasted peanuts for that taste. It gives it a special taste. So when you put it in the oven for like 10 minutes, depending, okay, let me just um, um, give you the, let me give you the um, whatever, if you're using one cup, let me give you the, <laughs> let me be scientific. So you can preheat your oven for like um, 350 firing hats. And then grease your oven pans, and then in a medium bowl, combine all the ingredients after we have done. You whisk it, then you divide it into like one or two loaves pan that you like. And then remember, your oven has been preheated for 350 Fahrenheit. So you can use a low heat method and bake it for like 10 minutes, five to 10 minutes, and then you check it. And then you, if it's, once you touch it and it's just puffy, don't bake until it's hard. If you bake until it's hard and you bring it out, it's going to become too hard. It will be like quilly quilly. It will be like quilly quilly. You can see that this, my own, is soft. You can still touch it and it will press down. This is even a little too hard. Okay? Almost like quilly quilly. So, if you don't want it to be like that, like for microwave, one minute, one and a half minutes is okay. And for oven, five to ten minutes is okay. All right. Okay. Um. Agent and study says because of the unsaturated fats with peanuts, though high in protein, I usually don't make it my base. Eh, you can use that. That's what I say. You can use mm -hmm. any nuts you like. Okay. Peanuts is very good. I know that nuts are fattening. That's why you should not eat so much quantity of it. And then um, almond is better if you have almond. But remember, in Nigeria, many of us cannot lay hands on almond, so you can use your peanuts moderately. Like this loaf I made now, the one I'm showing us, is just half cup of peanuts, half cup of peanuts, and you can have half cup of peanuts if that's what you're having for your food. You're not adding other things. It's very okay for you. Okay, Uche. All right. um do you do we toast the nuts before making nuts yes i i made this one i bought peanut that's already made as a peanut gram nuts that you can eat okay but like i said you can use raw one the tastes are different this taste is better than the raw one thank you Uche. hello grace how are you guys stanley okay i've asked you yes fresh peanuts will not be sweet so if you're using fresh peanuts, you have to add sweetener, things like that. But if you roast the peanut a bit, it's very good. It will give you that good taste, okay? All right. Veronica Odeme, thank you. Salt over. Thank you. Mary Ekena, thank you. I hope there's nobody I'm forgetting. <laughs> yes, moderation is the key. Moderation is actually the key. So... Like this peanut butter bread now, you, you don't eat it alone, okay? You don't actually eat bread alone during breakfast. So, like for me, 
if I'm eating it for breakfast, I will have my, remember my portion control. 75% of vegetables already have it. I'm just tasting, tasting for us. You see, if I open my fridge right away, you will see that I'm bringing out my cut salad that I'm going to, we're using for breakfast. So we're using one bag for me, one bag for my husband. So that's the vegetable we're having with that half cup of peanut butter bread that we've made. So that's good breakfast for you. And then I'm having green tea with it, okay? So it's like 10.40 a.m. here in London, Ontario, Canada. So it's still breakfast time, okay? All right, so that's it. Do I have any other question? I don't know if I'll be able to do almond today. Time has gone, and with this one finger, I might not be able to. I need to bring out blend. I've already blended some more. It just I didn't blend very well. And for that peanut butter, uh, for that almond, I'm supposed to need a bit, and I don't have finger for kneading. So where am I on Wednesday? Next week Wednesday, I'm still here. So we'll do almond bread next week Wednesday. Please pardon me, everyone, because of this finger. I want to see you put it in the chat room if you pardon me for making only peanuts today. Next week we'll make um, almond and I'm also going to teach you one or two um, dressing, okay? Bread dressing, just to make up. This finger is it's supposed to be hurting me, but it will not hurt me. Jesus, <laughs> I'm so afraid to untie it. It's quite much. You know how this blender can be very, very sharp. I've already blended a bit because when I did the, it cut my finger, I was so afraid to remove the peanut from the container. So it's still, it's still inside the, it's still inside the, <laughs> the peanut is still inside. I'll finish up. So, but I've started blending the, the almond, but the problem is that I'm using a food process, so I didn't wash that one. So it didn't blend, let me show you, it didn't blend very well. It's a bit too coarse, cool, and I need to blend it very well. And again, my, the other blender that I would have used, I need to wash, see water, so... I can use one hand to wash something that has blade. So that's the problem I'm having. So if you've pardoned me, let me see it here in the chat room. And thank you to all of you that said sorry. And thank you for joining me. And remember once again, to the four things keep you going. The first one is make sure that you are exercising. And on Saturdays, we have our fitness exercises i'll be in a hotel on saturday i'll see if i can go live i'll try i'll try i'll try i'll try i'll try and go live because it's quite early it's going to be like um 6 a.m but is it 6 a.m no 7 a.m today was our 4 a.m nigerian 7 a.m was our was it 4 a.m or so so it's going to be very early in the morning so if i'm in a hotel i'll go live but here I, a, B, and B, because we have other people who are in the rooms. If I talk, I'm going to make noise. And if I come out in the sitting room, I might also make noise. But when it's in the hotel, I know it's soundproof and I can do that. Okay, so on Saturday, see you on Saturday for that. Tomorrow is our financial health day. Make sure you join us tomorrow. We are going to be talking about some seven lessons. You will see the posters today sent to you. And remember, it's customer service week. Wow! <laughs> so, I'm going to launch my customer service today. For those of you who have been buying, make sure you chat me privately. This is for customers, not for new people. I'm doing a mind-blowing discount for my customers. And when I say mind-blowing, it's really, really mind-blowing. I'm giving you what I'm buying. I'm going to give it to you at the rate I'm buying, okay? And if you doubt me, I will give you a link. You enter the link and you will see the price. and see that that is what I'm purchasing. That's what I'm giving you. I'll just give you that link. You enter the link and you will buy it what I'm buying, okay? Because it's only for my customer. So it's not the one of, mm -hmm. is it payment or delivery? Anybody that is payment or delivery is not my customer. My customers trust me and 
they pay before delivery. So this is the time for all you customers to come and buy your products in bulk. I'm giving it out because it's customers week from my heart with love so that you can glow. Just say I'm glowing. Yes. If you need family complex, there for you. <laughs> Marine collagen, aging, um, vitalized women, royal jelly. These are all anti-aging products that I use. You see, no wrinkles, no folds. Very, very good for you. Okay. Strength, energy, you know, revite, rejuvenation, stamina. This is the time to get all your products. And stock up. I always tell people when I do this promo, stock up. It's, it doesn't come very, very cheap and it doesn't come all the time. All right. So, do I have any other question before we call it a day? I remember. Um, to join us tomorrow. I remember to join us tomorrow. Remember to join us tomorrow. All right. Okay. Um, thank you, Yola. Thank you. Ah, Buki is here with me. <laughs> That's the my host is here with me. Mina Jack, hello. Thank you for joining me. Agent and Stanley said well understood. Thank you, Dobiko. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay, as I said, I should take care of myself. I sure will. Marvelous, take care of yourself. I sure will. Oh, no, he didn't get to the bone, Uche. He didn't get to the bone. Ah, there was one time I caught myself to the bone there. Eh? It was one time that my husband came back from America and he was still trying to adjust to the timing. So he was very hungry to hear me in the morning. In early in the morning, I was telling him eat, eat, eat when I was going to bed. He said he wasn't hungry, so he now woke me that he needed food. Oh my goodness, that day! So I was caught, and I don't know if it was sleep, I was sleeping or what. I just caught my finger to the bone, the thing fell to the floor. My husband said, hey, I'm not eating again. He just hugged me <laughs> since that time. Anytime he came out from America, ah, he will just let the food be there. If he's hungry, he will wake up and eat it. <laughs> thank you. Thank you, Mina Jack. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Hello. Ah, my sister is here. Uche Joko. The first class uh, family. <laughs> How are you? <laughs> you need vitamins. Vitamin D. Okay, Esther, chat me. Once I drop now, I'm going to um, give you the number that you collect from. Okay, Esther is one of my downlines. So she's one of my my mentoria mentoring her remember like i said she's into spices and aging and stunning that has been talking is also my mentor she's also into weight loss uche has big testimony she was going uh, way so had so much weight had issues with health here and there but she met me on facebook as i was doing my life and she chatted me uche is in dublin okay that's how i introduced her to the products and Uche started the product and Uche lost 23 kilograms. Every illness, health issue she was having stopped. And I mean every. And Uche said, is this me? I can remember. She said, is this me? I can't believe this is me, mama. I can't believe this is me. So she joined me and she's touching lives all over the world. Not only in Dublin. In that Dublin, she has helped many people to lose weight and become healthy. I can count more than 30 people she has helped just in Dublin and so many people all over the world. And that's why I'm asking you, what are you waiting for? Internet, social media has made it so easy for us to be able to reach the world with your talents, your hobbies, what you love doing. Just chat me on my WhatsApp number, plus 234-703-515-1642 and I'll hold you by the hand and I'll teach you what you can do so that you can become the best of you and also help other people to become their best. Uh, where's my phone number so I can pin it? <laughs> Where did this phone number go to? Uh -uh. Uh, Raymond, if you're here, send, put my um, phone number and pin it, okay? If you're here, put my phone number. I don't know why. I, I thought I had typed it. Okay, before I close, I'm going to type it. So Uche, Uche chatted me and that's how she became healthy. Esther, the same thing. 
Jennifer in Italy, so many other people. It's not about people say I don't like multi-level marketing, I don't like, like network marketing. It's not about network marketing. We are influencers, we are health enthusiasts, and we help people to become healthier, to become the better. We help you to become the better you. Okay, and in doing it, one of the ways to maintain is to also help others. That's what we're doing. So when I joined the business, I joined the business because I wanted a healthier me. When I became healthier, I started helping other people. And I've done this for nine years now. So I have hundreds and hundreds of people who have helped to, you know, be rejuvenate, be healthier, be stronger. Is it arthritis? Is it diabetes? Is it high blood pressure? Is it menopausal issue? That is my center. You know, I've helped a lot of people to become a healthier themselves okay and once in a way tell people don't throw away your drugs don't throw away your medications continue with your medications join me and do what we're doing is the doctors that we tell you to stop those medications okay all right okay so my whatsapp number is already pinned raymond thank you for pinning my whatsapp number for me and then you can also watch the replay if you missed any episode if you've missed this episode, watch the replay, okay? All right. Thank you all for joining me. Keep following us, and thanks for following us. And remember, it's customer service week. So, Raymond, help me. I know you're online. Help me to do a customer service poster, okay, which I'm going to post to those who are on WhatsApp. That's why I'm telling you to join. Chat me on WhatsApp so you can join our WhatsApp group broadcast is not a group i don't run group i don't have time to run group <laughs> i come live we answer the questions live and then you can chat me privately i deal with your personal issues privately and that's it all right so thank you all for joining me if you're going to try the peanut bread peanut butter bread please put it i will try that's all i need from you i will try i will try i will try <laughs> thanks a lot so see you on wednesday when we do our almond bread, I'm going to tie and keep this almond that I've blended now. We will use it and then I'm going to show you one or two things. I'm not sure. I'll seek out the ingredients. If I find them around me here, then I'll show you. Remember in Aging with Grace that we use local things we can find around us to teach you how you can use them to remain healthy using exercise, diet, nutritious diet, supplementation, and lifestyle change. Thank you all for joining me. Um, Esther Wilson, don't worry, you can watch the replay. <laughs> Esther Wilson is one of my mentors also in Uganda. She's in Uganda, okay, and she has started touching lives using this product. Love you all. Bye.